this is Kristen with JBN Media, and I'm sitting here with Paula Garces. Hey, guys. <laughs> so tell us a little bit about the project you were just explaining to me beforehand and like give viewers an insight of like this world you created. Sure. Aluna is a Latina superhero. It's a character that I co-created about nine years ago. Uh, it's a series of eight books. We have four in production. Book number four is what I debuted at this year's Comic-Con. And it's a superhero set in the 1500s. So imagine if all the Latin American and South American and Central American ancient tribes had a superhero. What would have happened to our history? What if she like gave the conquistadors hell and grew up and was raised as royalty in Spain? And that's what the character goes through in my comic book. And when she comes back to the new world, she has superpowers. So she um, claims her true destiny and tries to save her people. So think Apocalypto meets Pirates of the Caribbean. Uh, there's a love triangle. There's a lot of action. Uh, there's monsters and mysterious creatures in the Amazon jungle. So all of that. Awesome. That sounds wonderful. It Thank all you. sounds really amazing. So like, what was your biggest inspiration for this? Because I know, as I was saying before, like as Latinas and like our culture and stuff, like yeah. was that something you really wanted to make an impact with? Because I know it's important to show that diversity with any art you put out. Well, I've been acting for almost 30 years and I've done pretty well. I've been on TV shows like The Shield and done movies like Harold and Kumar. And right now I'm doing a movie on... Uh, um, a TV show on Netflix called On My Block. Okay. And season two uh, is coming out soon, and that's pretty popular. But uh, about 10 years ago, I was really frustrated that there weren't any Latina characters being properly represented in comic books or video games or any action movies, really, that I wanted to be a part of. So my husband was like, my co-creator, <laughs> we're at Comic-Con. <laughs> My, was like, you know what, stop being frustrated, just create your own thing. And I was like, you know what, yeah, I can definitely create something. And so I came up with Aluna. I wanted to come up with a Latina character that would include all kinds of Latino culture. So not just South American, not just Central American, but I also wanted to put the Caribbean in there. So Aluna infuses all of those cultures. <laughs> Uh, together okay. uh, and it's it's basically if what if we had one superhero and she's a badass Latina and um, this is it Aluna so okay. hopefully you guys will check her out uh, you can go to my website paulagarces.com and follow me on Instagram at paulagarces1 for Twitter uh, Instagram is at the real paulagarces uh, and just try to buy the books, uh, buy t-shirts, and really um, support the cause. Because my dream would be to have Aluna as a TV show. So I'm hoping the Netflixes of the world and Amazon or Hulu, uh, I hope that that's what they're looking towards. Okay. That sounds like, honestly, all of this is almost breathtaking to me because it's so nice to finally see that representation. So for somebody like myself or maybe even younger women, younger boys out there who want more Latino representation and want our stories to be told, like what kind of advice would you give somebody who's trying to navigate through that path? Well, I'll give you a great example. I'm part of a show called On My Block on Netflix. And when it first dropped, um, Netflix, I mean, they were into it, but there wasn't like a lot of um, publicity on the show and what we did is that we went online and we asked our viewers if you love the show please share it please tell your people to share it your tias your uncles your mothers your grandmas abuelitas everybody and they did and because we were active and really truly passionate about the show we got a season two so what I would tell young people if you have a dream, no matter what it is, whether it's to be an actor, a writer, a creator, a spaceman, or a doctor, whatever it is, it's all about perseverance. It's all about getting out there. If you're really passionate, do what you love, and you will love, you will actually do, you will end up doing something that you're really passionate about, right? And it's all about being disciplined and dedicated. And even, I mean, I got a million no's. I've been in the business for 30 years. I've gotten more no's than, than the yeses I've gotten, but the yeses I've gotten have been pretty special. So 
uh, Aluna, I've gotten a lot of no's. And every time I come to Comic-Con, I get yeses. I get people like you who are totally into the movement. And so it gives me confidence and it gives me an oomph to keep going. So it's just all about dedication, perseverance, being disciplined, and getting the word out there. Even if people tell you you're crazy, maybe you are a little. <laughs> Right? Yeah. All the crazies coming yeah. out. <laughs> okay. Well, thank you so much for taking the time out of your day to talk to us about this. This is really beautiful what you've done here, thank and I'm really you. glad you sat down and took the time out of your day to do this. No, so thank you. Guys. Thank Please you. Me again on Instagram, Paula Garces, the real Paula Garces, Twitter, Paula Garces One, and go to www.polagarces.com for any of the comic books and more information on the Aluna movement. Thank you. Thank you. Hi guys, it's your girl Paula Garces, creator of Aluna Comics, and that's turning another page with Gene Buckner. <laughs>